All right, here you have it. Get the instructions out of the box, lovely jubbly. Uh, make sure you set it at the top end because there's far better 4G up there than there is by the tennis courts and clubhouse, surprisingly. Uh, get the stand up, get the legs out nice and wide, so lovely jubbly. Get this little contraption out uh, that basically goes on top of the stand and makes you and make and you can now maneuver the camera about with that on through a remote control. So this is the cable going in, which has a remote control on the side. Get the camera out as well now. Uh, put the camera on top and try and interlock the cables beneath the camera so they stay nice in a nice place. And this will be a mini HDMI cable and also the power source. So get that into either side of the camera and you should be good to go. Next up, get this green screen thing, uh, put the HDMI cable into it and the battery uh, get the battery going, which is coming out of the box now. Lovely jubbly. Uh, get the cables right, so there's a car charger thing that goes into from that to the camera and also the HDMI uh, from the camera to the video, uh, video player. So what this does, this just makes sure you can see what you're aiming at uh, when you get the camera to the very top. So here's that car charger going from the battery to the uh, video screen. And when you turn the battery on, uh, there'll be red flashing light. That means it's fine. Uh, so carry on with that as usual, and it should last about 20 hours. Um, great. Now Charlie Aaron's got involved and offered nothing. Uh, so now it's time to put the stand up to the very top. Um, if I was you, keep the HDMI cable into the video camera. You should be good to go, and then navigate it through uh, the remote control on where you want to aim at it. As soon as you've done that, get the encoder out of the box. This is where you'd also need to put the HDMI in and then switch the power from the um, from the screen to uh, and the battery from the battery to the encoder. And then from here, uh, you need a solid blue light on where the 4G represents, as this is run off 4G. Until you get the solid blue light, it won't come online. All the games should be on YouTube that we send to Frogbox, so it's good to go from here. Enjoy.